Hey guys, so it's been about three weeks and I am itching, not literally because I cleaned my hair, but I am ready to get these braids out of my head. I want to see my curls and I'm just kind of over it. So I did notice that my roots did gradually get looser throughout the week, but that's kind of normal anyway. My hair does that anyway. Like I told you, it's really hard for me to get my roots really tight. So my hair usually looks like this because it's just, it fights protective styles and it just doesn't want to behave. So this is kind of normal. I am ready to take it out and have my own hair back. So I promised you that I would do it on camera. Here I am, I'm going to take these out so we can see together if we got any damage from those rubber bands. I don't think we will. I hope that we won't. So let's just go ahead and do this right now. Um, I can't remember how long my hair is. So unfortunately, we're gonna have to go all the way at the bottom. No shortcuts. Just gonna clip the bottom of the hair off. Oh, see, look, there's my hair. Oh, my hair is longer than I thought it was. Oh, I don't know why I thought my hair was like bangs in the front. We just slide that off. <laughs> and there it goes. That rubber band actually just broke on its own. I'm like, where's the rubber band? It's right here in the hair. It completely broke off on its own there. Look at that. Cool. So, there's my hair, no damage. Ooh, look at my hair. <laughs> I'm like a kid in a candy store. I'm so excited for my hair to be out. All right, one down, about 27 more to go. I don't know how many braids I have in here, but I'm assuming probably about 30. All right, here we go. Number two, the, look, the rubber band is completely gone. Here's another broken rubber band for you. Those clear rubber bands are a blessing and a curse. I love that they just break on their own if they're under too much pressure, that way they won't break your hair. But that's bad if you're doing a style and you actually need the rubber band to stay, so it's a blessing and a curse. Right now it's a blessing. My hair is all still there, not damaged. Rubber band. Broken. I have a feeling these are all gonna be broken. Much shedding. It's in here. Ah. That's it. That's it for shedding, like two pieces of hair. Wow. I mean, I expected at least a little bit of shedding. This has actually blown my mind. This rubber band literally did zero damage. I knew it would be gentle. I didn't think it was gonna be like completely no damage. I was expecting at least like three broken hairs, nothing, nothing. So I love the style because it gave me a break. It was really easy to put in. And so far, it's really easy to take out. So I mean, this is, this is an ideal protective style. Yeah, broken up my hand. There it is. There goes that rubber band. Are completely disintegrated. Look at this. Ah. This is our first one where the rubber band is still intact. Nice. But look how easily it breaks off. The hair is not broken. Look at the really nice roots. Beautiful. This is normal shedding that I have very small amount. I mean, my hair was in these braids for three weeks. You would expect it to be more than this, so this is great. Wow. Wow, that was so easy. <laughs> It took me 40 minutes to take these braids out of my hair. So quick, so easy. And I have, as far as I can see right now, I have no damage, less than normal amount of shedding. I mean, it feels soft. 
I'm so excited about this. This is crazy. So these clear rubber bands are definitely clutch. Most of them broke in my hair as I figured they would. So that means that they stayed put long enough to do their job, which was to get my roots tight enough for me to braid the hair in. And then once they got under too much pressure, they just disintegrated and broke. There's only maybe like four or five sections where the rubber band actually didn't break and stayed in my hair. But then as soon as I went to go take it out, it broke immediately really easily. So if you do decide to do the regular rubber bands, they'll probably stay put the entire way. Just make sure that you lift the rubber band out and cut it out rather than like trying to ravel it out because then you might break your hair off. This worked out really well. I got a nice break, good protective style. It was easy to put in, it was easy to take out. I mean, what more can you ask for? This was great. I'm happy and I'm excited to go wash my hair feels good so I hope this video helped so you could see that this method was definitely gentle on your hair i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you in the next one Bye.